crazy family and welcome back to yet another episode of Trollcraft. So, um, yesterday was Sunday day. That means that he's probably heard my diss track by now and has probably trolled me in one way or another. And as you guys know, Sunday is pretty much like the troll master. Actually, no. <laughs> That's me. No, but he, he's really good at trolling, so I am kind of scared. But before we log into the server, real quick, you guys know the drill. Hit that like button down below. Hit that subscribe button once you've done that. Let me know down in the comments that you did that and also include your Minecraft name. And if you don't have a Minecraft name, I'll just write down your YouTube name and put it on the fan wall. And I got a name today, so we'll put that uh, in a second. But first... Let's get right into the server. Also, oh yeah, I actually have an achievement that we can cross King Slime. Why did I just say King Slime? Okay, so nothing new here except for a bunch of freaking uh, and a portal. There's a portal. I mean, there's just a bunch of pigmen, but that, that's that's not really news to me. Uh, what the crap? Uh, uh, okay, well I'm completely out of lava. Which means I'm probably also out of power. Yep, <laughs> completely out of power. Oh my goodness. All right, well, we have to fix that. But first, let me uh, give a shout out to the person that deserves a shout out. I don't have any freaking signs right now and I can't get into my enemy system. But we shall find a way to do it. Okay, so I got the head now. And uh, the guy's name is Ruby Dragon 63 Now let's see. Has anybody seen my uh, magical secret? No. Okay, looks fine. Okay, awesome. Let's put this guy's head down. Shout out to you, Ruby Dragon 63 Thank you for supporting the last video I uploaded, man. I do really much appreciate it. So there we go, man. Now we actually need to go to the nether and see if we can gather ourselves all of the... I've put down a lot of endothermic pumps down here. You guys know they don't really... Oh my goodness, really? Did, have I really made all of the man? But yeah, you guys know they don't really require uh, that much to make. But I think I've made like maybe five of them and just put them all around down here. So let's see if we can find them. Okay, there's one over there. Is this mine? Yeah, it's mine. You can see that on the color scheme of it. All right, let's take this right there. And uh, you get the freak away from me, sir. I don't even know what you are, but you get away. Uh, so yeah, I, I didn't really see any troll from Sunday, but it is Sunday, so he definitely has trolled me somehow. I just don't know how, dude. There's another one right here. Okay, sick. Now, the problem is, uh, the good thing about these guys is that, uh, I mean, it's pretty easy to spot where you've put them, because they just, like, change all the lava to stone. So that makes it fairly easy, but the bad news is... Uh, I, the waypoints kind of get deleted whenever you relog. Uh, so I don't have any waypoints as to where I have put them in, in like, previous, uh, when, when I've been down here, right? But, oh, I think we'll be fine. I actually forgot to put a waypoint on the portal back home, but I think it's, like, over, yeah, it's right up there. Alright, so if we just put, like, a waypoint right here, we should be able to find our way back, right? Let's just do it right here. Home. Alright, okay, there, there's a bunch... A bunch of stone over here. Saw that on the minimap. So let's try to go in this general direction. Hello, uh, Nether. Have you seen my uh, endothermic pump systems? Oh, there's one right there. Okay, sick. There should be some more. I hope there are some more. I think there is. And uh, the problem with these guys is that they don't really... I mean, it, they do drain a lot of lava. It's just not a, a, as big of an area as you want, I guess you can say. Yeah, I don't see any down here, dude. Have, have we taken them all? We might have taken them all. I, th I think we've taken them all. Okay, so now we just need to relocate them. And we need to relocate them in a in a place where there's more than enough lava, right? So let's try to go this. Yeah, this is a big lava pool. All right, yeah, let's put it right here. Take some of this as well with us. Just to make sure we can actually build right there. All right, I guess we can just build it out here somewhere in case you guys have missed me doing this before i'm just gonna show uh, show you how i do it once and then i'm just gonna uh, wait where did my endothermic pumps go what did my inventory just mess up what the 
Oh, there they are. What what the crap was that? <laughs> Alright, put it right there. Uh, lava generator right, right there. It already has power in it, so that's perfect. Now we just put the ender tank on top of it, and that's basically how it goes. Uh, oh yeah, I also need to put down chunk loaders. So yeah, I'm gonna put down the rest. You guys don't need to see that, as you've already seen me do it a thousand times before. So uh, be right back, guys. It's gonna take a while to do, to be honest. Okay, I put them all down now, so let's head back home. And uh, hopefully this is gonna be enough to, like, last us for a few more days. I, I, I just have to really find a better way of getting lava than the one I'm doing right now. Because honestly, it's kind of annoying to always go down here and kind of replace them. So I'm gonna be doing a little bit of googling. You guys can also let me know down in the comments. How would you do it? There are probably way better ways, ways of doing it than I'm doing it right now. It's just my way is really cheap and like really easy to do as well. So I think that's why I kind of stuck to it. But I think it's about time that we change things up a bit, right? Like we've had that system for ages. Maybe honestly, maybe we should just go back to solar or uh, wind. Windmills because those are really good too. Oh my goodness. I keep forgetting that it sends me here All right, we just need to go in this direction and then we should be good. Uh, but yeah, maybe we should go back to windmills Not entirely sure uh, because I actually found out that you can stack those on top of each other for as much as you want Right, so you can basically just make like a freaking tower all the way down from bedrock to all the way up to the uh, to the built limit like pretty much you can actually do that if you wanted to right it's not Probably not that clever to do, but it would still be kind of cool, right? It would probably lag the server a whole lot, though. Anyway, what's this? What the crap is this? Why is this out here? Uh, that was at Ian's base before, right? Why the crap is that all the way over there? Uh, okay, oh, what? There's no more lava around here? What the crap scene? What happened? I swear it wasn't me. Is that skies? Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. Look at that. <laughs> I swear this wasn't me scene. I really hope you don't judge me for taking this obsidian, but I totally will. There we go. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, can I put this into my... Wait, is my system not filling up yet? I really hope that... I am getting lava. I should be getting lava right now. I don't see why not. But yeah, scene. I hope you don't judge me for removing all of this. Actually, scene, you know what? I might be doing you a favor right now. So if I am doing you a favor by removing some of that stuff, uh, let me know and like hook me up with some free swag. You know what I'm saying? Uh, okay, let's look. Oh, wow. It's definitely filling up. Holy crap, man. That is filling up so fast. Okay. Wait, so why isn't my stuff getting any power? Okay, here we go, man. We now got power again. How beautiful is that, man? All right, so let's actually see how much that. Ooh, I have a lot of diamond essence, man. I need to actually automate this at some point, you know, just, just so it can, like, go a bit faster than it currently is. And so I don't have to manually do it myself either. Like, it, it, it kind of sucks doing it by yourself. You know, I'm not really complaining, but at the same time, I'm complaining, homie. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, so I have to figure out First of all, I don't see any troll from Sunday, so he might not have trolled me this week Um, He might not have like I don't know this is definitely filling up so that's good There are a lot of tanks to fill up though, so it does take a little bit of time Oh, yeah, I need to put down a sign at that location. Also, I'm gonna put this to the side right now. Uh, let's see if we can find a sign. We have one right there. But yeah, we need to find a way to pay back uh, Sparkles. Because he did that troll on us last time, which was he gave us back. Um, what was this guy's name again? It was something. Ruby Dragon. There we go. Ruby Dragon. And then it was 63. Uh, oh, I did it wrong. Uh, sorry, Ruby Dragon. <laughs> okay, Ruby Dragon. 63 but yeah, he did that troll to us last uh, time which I think was yeah That was the base full of obsidian, right? Uh, but then he also gave us back Alfred. So wait, what the crap is this? What the crap? Oh Are those mining lasers? Wow, really? There's a tesseract right here. Wait, okay. Wait, so what's down here? Sorry, I'm breaking through right now. Holy crap. Oh my goodness! Wow! 
Okay, he's balling, man. Captain Sparkles is freaking balling with those mining lasers, homie. All right, so what can we do? What can we do to Captain Sparkles that would make him really upset? Huh. I'm not sure. I, I, I really don't know. We've done so many trolls now. There are still a lot. Oh, yeah, I need to cross off that achievement. Throw our tent a party with your neighbors. Introduce yourself. Yeah. Because yesterday, Sunday invited me on the server and he threw a party. But as you can see, it also says attend. So, uh, yeah, we also got an achievement right there. So that is awesome. We need to go get some achievements soon, man. It's been a while since we've actually done, like, an achievement episode. Um, what's up, Pikmin? <gasps> if I could fill his uh, entire base up with Pikmin. So oh. Oh. I think I know what I can do. Golden lassos, bro. Alright, maybe this is gonna take a while to do, but it should be really awesome. Anyway, we can actually take some from our base. We have a crap ton running around here, right? No, wait, they're all gone. Wait, wait. Where did they all go? Where did they all go, dude? Oh, yeah, you also have to give them a name tag if you don't want them to despawn, right? I can do that. I can call them all, like, Lel or something. So what I'm gonna do, we're gonna go to the nether, snatch one of these guys in a... Oh. Wait, you can't get them in a golden lasso? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, Safari. <gasps> you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna borrow Captain Sparkle's Safari Net. Because I'm pretty sure you can steal the Pikmin in a Safari Net. And then put him... Yeah. I think you could do that, right? Oh, my goodness. That would be so hilarious, dude. Let, let's just test it. Let's see if it works first, right? I haven't actually been through his portal to the nether. So, I kind of want to see what it looks like. Oh, it's the same one as mine. So, let's see. Yes! I can... can okay, so what I'm going to do... <laughs> Oh my goodness, you guys already know what I'm gonna do. I don't have to explain it. We're gonna capture a buttload of Pikmin, call them all Lil, and then trap them inside of his base, shall we? I think that's a good idea. Okay, so, um, you guys are gonna have to see this when Captain Sparkles upload, but let's try to go close to his base. There were already so many zombie pigmen down there, and I named quite a lot of them already Lil. But I have to wait until I actually can get some more experience. Alfred died? How the crap did Alfred die now? Wait, what? But yeah, I did already name some of them, but I have to uh, automate some experience. But that's pretty easy. What the? How did... There was a pressure plate right there killing Alfred, and a zombie pigment stepped over it. I basically just murdered Alfred. I basically just killed Alfred with my troll because I'm the one who made these little pigment and they went through Captain Sparkle's freaking thing. And they went through the portal in Captain Sparkle's base and in here. And they triggered something. Who put that there? Who just killed Alfred version 2, dude? I have no idea who just did that. Oh, no. Oh, no. You do not want to do that, good sir, whoever it was. I have no idea who it was. I'm going to say it was Sparkles. But, yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, my goodness. That just happened. That just freaking happened. Where is it? There it was. There it was. <sighs> Man, that's that's just mean. He's already a version 2, okay? It's not like I can keep affording to lose these guys, okay? They actually mean a lot to me, guys. Guys, dang it. Look at this room I gave them. They are literally my children. But yeah, as I was saying, man, you guys are gonna have to watch uh, Sparkle's episode when he gets on the server. I'm gonna have it done by then. But I'm gonna have to automate some experience getting, which is not that difficult. I already have some ideas for it. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be really annoying for him. But it's kind of uh, ironic how my troll just murdered Alfred. 
That sucks. But anyway, crazy family, that's gonna have to be for today's episode of Soulcraft. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that like button down below. Love you all. Hope you're having a fantastic day, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!